definitely love and the community has been really supportive. So. This really captures the spirit of the east side. Right? And it just really captures the spirit of the east. That's it, right? Yep. Yeah, you, you can feel the love here. Yeah, it's, it's definitely love and the community has been really supportive, so I appreciate it. All right. Let's see what's next. Syncing up some audio. Yep. That's probably the best piece I've had in a while. Love it. So this this shot right here was incredibly dark with too much backlight over here. And it's because of this backlight that this shot turned out kind of in a cool temperature and dark. So I just did some color adjustments uh, with the Lumetri color to make it warmer and expose it up a little bit, warmed it up a little bit. So you can get a before and after. But it also makes this, it, this is still really bright over here. So what I did is I uh, put a black solid over it um, and then I uh, used the pen tool to make a mask around uh, around the door and uh, around the entire thing here. And it really is just a, uh, it's, it's just a black solid really. Um, but I also turned the feathering up so it's not a hard line. So I feathered it to keep some depth in there and uh, to keep it from uh, having a hard edge. And then I just turned the opacity down a little bit. Um, actually quite a bit. I turned it down to about 30. That way we can have a nice, uh, not as bright there, and it kind of really evens out the picture. The magic of editing. Simple. <laughs> I'm just gonna listen. This is JB, the owner. How you doing, man? So uh, tell us what makes East Side different than other pizza places in Oklahoma City. Uh, East Side Pizza House is different because of the location. We are located right in the heart of, of the northeast side of Oklahoma City. Everything inside of our spot is dedicated to this side of town, from the history to the streets to the neighborhood. The importance of having your 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 darks, your blacks, your your shadows being at the bottom of the scope and your highlights and your whites being at the top of the scope um, is what creates contrast and uh, dynamic range in your image. So if I had to take this contrast and you watch the image, it'll become flat. If you watch the scope over here, um, it'll, it'll pull the blacks up and the, and, and the highlights down and it'll actually make this really flat looking image. And um, what you want is you want more contrast, more yeah, dynamics. Oh yeah, I can totally see that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So like that. But yeah, you can use your color scopes for that. Fascinating stuff. Yeah. And you know, like the contrast between the blue shirt and the blue image here and then the yellow. And you know, that's probably why they painted this wall blue and yellow is because the blue and yellow are opposite complementary colors. Yeah. And that creates color contrast as well. But you definitely want a lot of contrast between your highlights and your shadows. As before, a little bit of color correction. So I'm actually just gonna isolate, let's say, let's say her jacket here. And then I'm going to say, okay, what is her jacket? I'm just going to look at just the colors in her jacket, maybe that face behind her, right? So I'm, I'm just gonna isolate some of those colors. Now let's say, I'm gonna turn that off. And I'm gonna go down here and I'm gonna say, oh, you know what? Let's make her jacket a different color. Let's maybe uh, make the tint a little different. Or you know what, let's make her jacket kind of gray. There we go. So now she's got a gray jacket. Or, or maybe she has a super blue jacket. Maybe she has a different tone or colored jacket. There you go. There's a magenta jacket or a purple jacket. But that's literally just changing her jacket. And yeah, it's, it's in video, so now she's got a purple jacket. Huh. You definitely have a very loyal fan base here already. Yeah. East Side Pizza House. I felt like that was it. That was good. It is my new favorite pizza place. Finished up an editing session with Wes. The footage is looking awesome. It is sounding awesome. This commercial is gonna be a thousand times better than I had ever imagined.